So I'm a huge hip hop fan and one thing that has always fascinated me about the culture is rappers having notebooks and notebooks full of lyrics. Yeah, I write songs and that's what I like. I, I do music. These are full from front to back of just songs, pages and pages of lyrics and ideas. In a way, writing down lyrics on a notebook is an artistic form of journaling when you really think about it. You're expressing yourself, you're writing about your emotions, your pains, your struggles, your relationships, things that you are just dealing with on a daily basis can become songs. Looking back when I was in high school, when I pretended to be a rapper at times, I would journal a lot in my phone, sometimes in the form of raps. That was back when I was going through some of the toughest times I've ever experienced in my life. Like my mother being diagnosed with breast cancer, societal pressure of just being a teenager, financial struggles in the household, and even just trying to decide what I was gonna do with my life after I graduated high school. Now, after almost 10 years, I finally rediscovered the benefits of journaling, and I'm also not trying to be a rapper anymore, and it's the reason why I'm doing it again on a daily basis. So I'm gonna break this video down into two parts. First, I'm gonna talk about the benefits of journaling and why I'm personally journaling on a daily basis. And then I'll mention how you can begin journaling if you are trying to dive into it and really start getting the benefits out of it. One of the biggest benefits of journaling for me is practicing more gratitude on a daily basis. We can easily get caught up in our own issues and struggles that we personally have going on in our lives and forget to be grateful about the things that we do have going on that are good. Writing down what I am grateful for on paper, especially in the morning, sets a tone for my day and reminds me of the good things I do have going on, such as my health, my family, my friends. I love that I'm also keeping a record of the things that are bringing me happiness throughout the days and I can look back and possibly cheer myself up with a few pages that are reminders for the things that I have to appreciate in life. Another strong benefit of journaling is that it can help you prioritize your fears, your problems and concerns you may have. Journaling can help you create order when there seems to be chaos in your life. You get to know yourself by revealing your most private fears, thoughts and feelings. As humans, we tend to bottle up our issues and not share them with others or even ourselves. Once you identify your problems and write them down, it can be easier to work on a plan to resolve them. Or you may realize you should talk with someone and seek help. Probably my favorite benefit since I've started journaling every single day has been my spark and creativity. About a month ago, I purchased this book by Julia Cameron, The Artist's Way. In this book, Julia describes that creative blocks, which all of us go through, you know that struggle if you're a creator, is not due to the fact that we're not creative is due to the fact that we haven't learned how to let creativity flow. And one of the main exercises in this book, which is like homework, is morning pages. Morning pages is just how it sounds. It's pages that you're writing in the morning. The first thing you do when you wake up in the morning is you grab a notebook and you just start writing without thinking. A stream of consciousness writing. This style of writing has really helped me come up with ideas and thoughts that I didn't know I had inside me and has also allowed me to really loosen up the way I express myself and the way I think. Julie recommends three pages right when you wake up in the morning. I can't express how much this style of writing has really allowed me to be more creative than I ever have been in over two years, has really got me out of creative blocks and especially has helped me stop from doubting myself. So how to begin journaling? My approach is very simple. I try to journal every single day. If I miss a day, no big deal, but I really make it a priority. First thing when I wake up in the morning, I write down my thoughts and ideas. If you write every single day, eventually it will become a habit and it'll be something that you will stick with. It doesn't matter if you journal on a composition notebook or a blank moleskin or just a notes app in your phone, just start journaling. So you might be asking yourself, what should I be journaling about? Well, just write whatever feels right. It's your journal, you don't need to share it with anyone so you can get as personal or as creative as you wanna get. There is no enforced structure, you can really just write and discuss whatever you want in your journal. That's why Julia Cameron's method from the artist way has been very powerful and has resonated with me very, very well because I can just write whatever is on my mind. I wake up and I just start jotting. I don't think, I just create. Make journaling easy. Keep a journal handy at all times. If you're going to write in the morning, place a journal where it's easily visible and you can't miss it when you wake up in the morning and you can just start writing. Do you journal yourself? Do you use a certain method like bullet journaling? I would love to hear the benefits that you get from journaling in the comment section below. Leave other methods that you might find that are very valuable and useful for other people in the comment section and Again, journaling is just a very creative way to express your thoughts and ideas or just the things that you're going through. And it's something that has really kept me more sane the last few months when it comes to anxiety, stress, and just really being calm and also uplifting myself and creating more and just being more creative. I feel like it's really allowed me to be more free and again, 
it's been very useful for me. So I hope you enjoyed this video and learned the benefits of journaling and how you can begin journaling right away. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see everyone in the next video. Peace. Yeah.